After coming to China, I've heard of Xi'an many times. It is said that it is one of the most historically significant cities in the world. My next destination is here, and I don't know what's in store for me this time. Are you curious? Then come along with me. Coming to Xi'an means coming face to face with the Silk Road. Next stop, the Legend of Camel Bells. After a dazzling performance, I made a new friend, Xiao Mo. He explained the story of the Silk Road and papermaking, and we agreed to go to the papermaking museum to have a look. In the Hanzhong Cailun Papermaking Museum, the old artisanal paper making process is on full display. Here, the master follows every step, collecting raw materials before soaking, chopping, washing, cooking, rinsing, simmering, and finally adding water to form a suspended slurry. Then, like magic, he sifts a sheet of paper out of the water it's no easy task. This环节就是切掉了，咱们把打好的瓤叠起来，用钢刀把它切成五毫米的薄片。你看，就这样把它一刀一刀这样切下来，你要不要试一试？ Okay. Oh yeah. Okay. I can feel it. Oh, oh. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> it's hard. This is difficult. Yeah, <laughs> 这边我们看到是打料的，这是需要两个人合作来完成的。We can try it. Cool, cool. Okay, okay, come on, come on. Okay, I'll try the side. Right, try. <laughs> All right, man, come on. Give me some energy. Put your back into it. Yeah, there you go. Oh, bro. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, oh, just kidding. Okay. <laughs> 特别细的那种竹篾特制的叫莲就这样轻轻的两下一张纸就已经捞出来了千万不要认为它简单哦这个看着简单做起来非常不容易的但是紧紧捞上来还不能算必须要把这纸顺利的从那个帘子上脱落
As I walked through the quiet path, I saw that the master was hard at work, using traditional methods to create paper. His skill and patience were moving. If you think about it, a piece of paper is just ordinary until someone takes a brush and writes characters upon it. Then it takes on a whole new life of its own. Although I've always been terrible at writing Chinese characters, after seeing today's process, I think that in the future, I'll have a much stronger motivation to keep practicing. Next time, when I write characters, it's going to be beautiful, and it's going to be on my own paper. Strolling through the art street, I'm surrounded by calligraphy and paintings. Here, ink glides gracefully off the brush, preserving the spirit of China's ancient capital city for 13 dynasties. Hey, teacher, hello. Hey, you are in writing or writing? I'm writing Chinese books. Wow,这样子汉字我没看过 日子,画一个圆圈 秦代的小传 行书草书人的生活节奏不断在加快所以我们的文字也在随着生活的改变而自然改变这就是中国劳动人民的智慧对比就是这个这是一个眼有个眼睛的眼眼睛这个能各个鸡蛋然后就是这样纸笔比如说
yeah. see. Mm, so it's this kind of very, very early kind of styles in the Chinese characters, like also evolution from the pictorial, right, yeah. uh, the, to the meaning word, yeah. I recognize some of these because yesterday I took this sort of calligraphy course with some masters. Ah, I see. Yeah, yeah. They explain the evolution of these characters. So the Chinese characters even follow the same way, you know, 2,000 years ago. We call it a, a small seal script. It's a standard word for the people used in the terracotta wars period, 2,200 years ago. Some words today we still use it. Wow. Right? 2,200 yeah. years ago. Yeah, like a four, right? Yeah, it's exactly the same. <laughs> Pretty much. Yeah. Accompanied by the guide, I saw how ink is cleverly used to transfer stone carvings onto paper. The craftsman places wet paper on the replica slab, quickly applying the paper with the brush. Then he pats the paper with ink, careful not to miss a spot. After three rounds of patting, all of the characters on the tablet are printed on the paper. It makes me wonder, is this the earliest download technology in China? There are so many great works of calligraphy here at the Stone Tablet Museum. Here I became familiar with all different styles of calligraphy that I've never even seen before. And honestly, it reminds me of the way English has many different fonts and styles. Calligraphy is more than just a beautiful art form. It's a window into Chinese culture and history. And the more I learn, the more I'm curious to find out. Art breathes beauty into a city, giving it its own qualities. And in Xi'an, even the corners of the smallest streets teem with a unique cultural atmosphere. Hang 中文写得不错 I already know a lot of Chinese characters, but today I learned that there are so many different ways of writing each word. I've always heard people say that writing Chinese is incredibly difficult, but after today's experience, I gotta admit, they're right. Calligraphy is a multifaceted art form incorporating brush, ink, and pen. It takes something that's already beautiful and makes it brilliant in a way that's hard to describe. Now, I'm more excited than ever to continue exploring China's rich culture. As my trip to Xi'an comes to an end, I realize that I really don't want to leave this city, and I don't want to be separated from my new friends. Oh, I'm going to return to Chengdu, my hometown, and do it come with me. And I will treat you with hot pot. Really? Yeah. yeah. That sounds fun. Okay. Ah, good afternoon, Xi'an. What a beautiful city. 